Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some popper slivers. Let's jump into this with a pretty interesting hand. Ugh. That's yucky. I think we're gonna keep it, though. It's just a yucky hand, though. Ugh. Makes me feel dirty. All these cycling and tap lands. Yuck. We gotta refill with Winding Way since we've only got a couple of slivers in our Benevolent Bodyguard, so. Let's see if they mulligan. They do. And looks like they put down their own. Okay, well, we got that. That's nice. Let's go ahead and just run out our two drops here and pass some ores of hmm. can't block and can't be blocked well I don't really care about that send up their mana base that's fine just gives an extra turn here Ooh. Would love to just play that right now. I wish we could. I think it's worth playing one of these lands out. Is it though? I feel like it might be worth playing out this one. So let's just play out this one. Uh, we can swing in with both because this thing can't block. Good to know he's a... Ch oh, he's a changeling, though. Okay, so we're beefing up his stuff. So we definitely should have played Predatory there. But that's all right. We'll get hit for two. Not a big deal. Another changeling. Uh-oh, all right. Now it's becoming a real problem. <laughs> yeah, that's not good. Oh... This is interesting, isn't it? So I could take out this guy. Uh, we could just... Let's go to combat first. See what he does. We can always give protection. A nice little Orzhov Changeling deck, which means they're probably getting close to playing. Uh, I'm gonna cancel this. It's not super effective this turn. I think I'm just gonna cycle this. Journey. Okay, that's useful. They're going to get close to playing that one card that can create like two of those changeling tokens. As long as you control a griffin creature, it gets plus three, plus three, and flying. And he does because of the changelings. How nice is that? That's cool. I like that. Just going to attack in with that guy. Okay. And another one. All right. All right, so... I think we're gonna journey one of these guys. Uh, no, this guy, sorry. Yeah. Let's journey him. We'll play our other flanking. Because then they're on a world of hurt if they try to flank, if they try to block with these flankings.
Double block? Okay. Yeah. It's a bad box still. I can give it protection. Double block there. Uh, sure, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. You can become two twos. We'll take out one of them. Uh, yes, yeah, so we'll just let this happen. And we'll pass. What else you got to play here? Another Griffin Rider? Okay, sure. Another Changeling. It's cool. These Changeling decks are always neat. We are gonna do Winding Way first. Things are about to get mighty interesting here. Flanking's not going to affect these guys, so I think we're just going to pass and set up for a bigger turn. News <laughs> too. Oh, that's funny. Uh oh. We're about to get hit for a lot. They have us on a two turn clock now with these changeling outcasts. That's funny. I always must type on this keyboard. I can't see the keys ever. Give him a nice deck. That's funny. We're in a bit of a... Bit of a little bit of a, a pickle here. And a bit of a mirror match situation almost. Which is funny. Oh no! Oh no, he can just finish me off with that. That's not what we wanted to really see here. Oh, man. Well, we're dead next turn, so we kind of have to alpha attack here. Just see what happens. Hope he messes up. <laughs> no matter what, we're dead next turn. <laughs> That's funny. Let's see if he said anything. Nah. All right, the game's over. Just do it. You do the blocks you need to do and kill me.
Did I, like, really confuse him? Is he, like, actually concerned for his life right now? He can just block a couple things and win. I'm, like, throwing him for a loop. He's, he's being extra careful. I get it. The mirror is very confusing. And this isn't even a mirror match, but it kind of is, which is hilarious. Yep, there you go. <laughs> He's, he's very concerned. He could have won if we had like a Vines of Astwood or something. That's how we would have won this, but. <laughs> he's so worried. <laughs> You're not dead. You're I'm dead. I'm dead. It's okay. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. <laughs> All right, let's go to game two, bud. Ah, so what do I want here? Probably Sunlance. Armadillo Cloak might be good just for getting past a bit of damage. Attacking with like one creature that it they'll just out buff them a little bit. Uh, let's take out. We're going to take out a lord, actually. So those lords just help buff his team. Sidewinders are good. Sinew is not so good. Benevolence kind of helped us just for giving protection, but they're not exactly necessary. Maybe I'll just cut one. Keep the journeys. Maybe we'll cut one more muscle. Sure. Keep our predatories. Those are the ones that are going to help us stay above the curve, but... That's the first time I've ever sided out lords. Hopefully that's the right call. But, I mean, there's reason to. There's a reason to side out a lot of this since we're kind of going up against a changeling mirror match for a certain degree. He's playing with slivers too. It's so funny. It's so funny. He's got a lot of really cool stuff going on with it. I would like to play first, yes. And this is a very, 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 very keepable hand. We just need one more mana for Armadillo Cloak, and we'll be set. We'll just play Predatory into our Armadillo Cloak. There we go. All right. Predatory. Swing for one. Why not, you know? Now we're going to have one decently big creature... That's not buffing their team. And that'll be gaining us life every turn. Just hopefully he doesn't journey it. Very well could. Griffin Rider. Alright, doesn't have a 3-3 yet. Alright, start getting ahead on life. We start pinging him down. We got a juicy target for uh, Journey to Nowhere, though. Oh, a changeling death touch. Ugh. Alright, good move, good move. So now we need our own journey. And he's got his own 4-4. Four, four. There's our journey. Okay. Let's take that away from you. Oh, 
we'll play out one of these. Just to get extra power going. Seems like they're a little bit slow here. That's nasty changeling just from how big his defense is. There's another one. I'm gonna go for winding way, try to find another predatory. Okay, I don't. swing uh, hmm. we don't quite have lethal so they could like triple block this thing well I guess I'd be okay because we can give protection to it sure let's let's just attack in keep the pressure on Say okay to that. Protection from white. Oh, did I just... Wait, I'm lost. I didn't realize that would take away my armadillo cloak when I gave protection. Never seen that interaction. It's already on the creature, but the protection puts it away? All right, well, that may have just cost us the entire game. What is this? I didn't realize it would completely take the armadillo cloak off of our creature. Holy crap, man. That's crazy. Well, we're going to make some pretty nutty trades here. We got lethal, so they got a chump block pretty decently. Kill a couple of theirs, they'll kill a couple of our lords. That sucks, man. I didn't know it would do that. Learn something new every day. That's crazy, though. They go to one. See, they need to get out a lot of creatures in order to win. Alright, so we win... Go to game three. I like what we had, but holy crap, that benevolent bodyguard thing was just not great. So maybe Apostle's Blessing is a better one-off in this situation. <laughs> not like it's bad, we just can't give protection to... something that has armadillo cloak I guess well, I guess if it's white or green if it's white or green we can't give protection to it if it has armadillo cloak on which I did not know I didn't realize it would destroy the aura like that ah we never played the possible blessing so let's try it it's a keepable hand it's just not an ideal hand not at all. They're going first. Yeah. Alright. Give me a one drop. Okay. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Frick. I wanted to play Blossoming Sands. Making mistakes, guys. Sorry. Sorry. I didn't know about the interaction last game about the Armadillo Cloak. That's my bad. Unknown interaction. 
All right, so they're starting off pretty dang strong. Well, let's get a body out there at least. And this is for only our creatures, so. Got a predatory, that's good. Decent Modern Horizon card. Uh, I am going to block this thing. Cool, you're just helping me out. Got a good setup here. You can't attack into the Sentinel right now. And we can drop our own Sentinel, our own Sinew and Predatory next turn. Or just Predatory into Winding Way into hopefully maybe another Predatory. I oh, know we can't do that. We've only got one green source. My bad. My bad. I've been recording all day, guys. All right? Lay off. Mistakes happen. I'm sick of hearing complaints. Just kidding. Nobody complains. It's just all in my head. Oh, playing with your own enchantments. Wait, mine's going to get it too, is, right? No? Enchanted creature and other creatures for sure. Whatever. Sure, I'll get hit for four. Probably gonna target that. Yeah. Well, let's let's go to swings first, see if they wanna like block for some reason. Nope. Okay, then we're gonna Oh it's it's a white creature. Always forget that. Always forget that. It's hilarious. Uh alright, let's just get some power. We can always jump block this sinew if we need to. I don't know why I always forget that Sunlance is non-white. I just think it's like the freaking lightning bolt of white and it can just target anything. Like a fool. A fool. Ooh. Ooh. Passing with a lot of stuff up. That's interesting. Let's do this. Creature. Just a plated. Not exactly what we want to see. What tricks do you have up your sleeve? Concerned about what they have going. Do I play this out? Become a 6-3. It's not gonna make. Uh, let's let's play it out, and we're just gonna attack in with our non-predatory. We'll just do that. See what they want to do. See what tricks they got up their sleeve with all their mana up. It's concerning. Sure. I would... Yeah, I mean, it's toss up. I'd almost take out my Sentinel, but... That's fair enough. I guess we'll throw this out. 
We'll see what happens. We're just never going to attack him with our predatory. We're not going to leave it up to chance to get taken out. So what didn't you play last turn that you should have played? That's nice. That's nice. Okay. All right. Very nice. Oh, attacking in with that, huh? Okay. I have to just attack in and get these creatures off the board and keep whittling them down. Please take 10 here. Double blocking, huh? Hmm. Who do I want to take out? Who's the more important guy? Probably this changeling. Yeah, it's fine. Keep this in our hand, maybe just representing something. Gaining some life back. Man, got some good synergy. I like it. <clears throat> These changelings are just everything, so they can put whatever they want in here and it'll just trigger it. It's pretty cool. One card in hand, though. Which means we can keep this pressure up. It's going to be a tight game. I don't want you to put down any more creatures, though, please. If they can keep just these two up, we might have a decent chance. What are you playing? Uh, okay. That's winding. Oh, my gosh. What is that? Well, we can at least target you. Do I attack with everything? No. I'm just going to do that. Was all a mistake. Now we just have to chump block some stuff. Don't tell me you got another one of those cards, the morsel thief. Do you? Can you finish us off? No. Well. See if we win this thing. We either do or we don't here. Lots of mistakes made this game. <laughs> do you have a way to stave off the rest of this? All right, we do. We get it. Ugh, sorry, guys, for some weird mistakes. I know. I'm aware. Some uh, kind of sketchy games, but we get we got it in the end. We pulled it through. That's it's a sketchy matchup when you're going up against a weird changeling mirror match not mirror match type thing but uh that was interesting 
I've only gone up against uh, another Changeling deck like once, and it was nothing like this. This is way, way better. Way more efficient. Way more efficient. Uh, cool. Good game, though, to our opponent. It was an uh, interesting game. I like it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, minus all those mistakes that were made. But, you know, uh, feel free to leave a comment below on what you thought of the deck that we just went against. I don't know. I'm just... I'm just shooting the breeze at this point, so... I don't know, guys. Well, uh... Yeah, subscribe for more Slivers. We'll have Gruel on Friday. And probably some more Mill. And, uh, I think we're gonna have some Call of Duty at the end of the week. So stay tuned for that, and we will see you in the next video.